Welcome back. Let me take you back in time. This wonderful event happened, as you see there, back in 2019. That's the last time the Dallas Mavericks hosted Dallas's annual St. Patrick's Day Parade. Well, it's coming back, we're happy to say. Returns to Greenville Avenue this coming Saturday. Our Steve Pickett shows you now. The parade is also a symbol of the city moving forward after two years of COVID cancellations. Dallas's Desperado's restaurant. Owner Jorge Levy, he is counting down to Saturday. <laughs> this is what Levy's Greenville Avenue restaurant sees yearly on that one Saturday in March. Dallas's St. Patrick's Day Parade and Festival fills this avenue with over 100,000 people every year. The largest one-day event now attached to a football game in Dallas. COVID canceled all of that for two years. It's now safe to say that Dallas is back. Yeah. Dallas Mayor Eric Johnson with Dallas Mavs legend Dirk Nowitzki as Grand Marshal both promoting the return of the city's Irish Parade and Festival for March 12th as a showcase of the city's return. This pandemic has been terrible. There's been a lot of grief. There's been a lot of suffering. But we've kept our heads up in this city, and we've worked hard to get to this point where we could safely do something like this again. Bring the people back together after uh, two, obviously, long and and hard years uh, worldwide. And uh, like the mayor said, this is, uh, I think, the biggest parade in all of Southwest. So. It is definitely the biggest day of the year. Jorge Levy will have his biggest day of the year back, he says. But the city will have Greenville as the gateway to a traditional gathering lost to a pandemic for two years. On Greenville Avenue, Steve Pickett, CBS 11 News.